Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing another Shein haul. I just picked up some really cute items that I found on the website. I tried to pair up the items and create little outfits like I did in the last video, but I'm not gonna lie. This one had a few misses, okay? It had a little bit of misses because I didn't take my time, okay, like I did last time. But if you guys want more videos like this where I'm showing you how to style the pieces by showing different items on the screen or if I actually have the items, then give this video a huge thumbs up and also comment down below and let me know. And yeah, like I said, this video has a few misses. Your girl tried, okay? So give me an A for effort or an E for effort. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next clip. So the first look, we have this top and the skirt and this top I got in a medium and the skirt I got in an extra small. And as you can see, the skirt is kind of cutting me off a little bit, but I need to fix it because it's looking a little unflattering but this is what i would pair with the skirt i found all of these items on shein as well and it's giving jacquemus vibes so i just wanted to stick with that theme and this is such a cute like vacation even if you're not going on vacation just summer in general it's a really cute look you can go out in this look during the daytime during the nighttime you could even wear sandals with this but i feel like i would want to wear heels because that's more of the vibe i'm going for with this look so next up is something that I was completely just trying out because this is not my style at all, but I actually kind of like it on me. It's very, very girly and different for me. So the top I got in a medium and the skirt I got in a small. And here are some items that I would probably pair with this. So you could bring out the color that like the peachy pink color and wear a peach bag or white, or you could do sandals, heels, whatever you want to do. And I really like the way that this looks. I feel like this top would look really, really cute with just some white jeans in general. And then you could do like a straw bag. You could do some straw sandals and just kind of like break it up a little bit instead of just doing white and peach. So next up we have this really, really cute bodycon dress. And this is literally like my favorite color. I'm pretty sure this color is called chartreuse if I'm not mistaken, but this dress I got in a size small and she looks so freaking good. As you can see, the back is cut out. So it just gives you like this, I don't, I just, I love this freaking dress. Okay, this dress is so fire. Like I love the way it fits. It just looks so good on my skin. I'm, I'm all the way here for it. So with this, I would definitely do gold accessories, like hella gold accessories, maybe even some gold heels, maybe some chartreuse heels to match the dress and you could do a gold bag, you could do a chartreuse bag, you could even do like a pop of color if you wanted to kind of make this pop a little bit and it would still look really, really good. So this outfit was a fail, so I didn't actually style it. I'm just showing you guys the pieces, so I'm not a huge fan. The way that I envision this in my mind is obviously not the way it looks in person, but I'm not gonna hold y'all this headband with this hair is adorable i freaking love it but this outfit not so much so this top i got in a size small and these pants i got in a size medium and i do like the pieces separately but it wasn't giving what i thought it would give so yeah this isn't going to get styled because i just this isn't the way that i envisioned it but this headband is freaking adorable with this top but yeah i like the two pieces separately and i definitely would have preferred like a turquoise top instead of a green one but you guys let me know down below if you guys like these pieces individually or together y'all let me know <laughs> so next up we have this top and these shorts so this top is in a size small and these shorts are in a size small as well and i'm not really feeling this the vision i had was a little different as you guys will see in this video your girl had some fails okay but this is still really cute on its own i do kind of like them together but i kind of don't i don't know how i feel about it exactly but if i were to style this you can definitely bring out the green the yellow the brown you have a lot to choose from so i just have some bags on the left and then some really cute heels you could do sandals they don't have to be heels they could be flats you could do whatever you want with this one but like i said i'm not a huge fan but i still kind of like it so next up, I think this outfit is super cute. This top is in a size small and these shorts are in a size medium. And I really love the color, the prints, everything about these shorts. And it looks really, really good on my skin. Even though it kind of blends in a little bit, it still looks really, really cute. So with this, I definitely would keep it simple. 
All of these are pretty simple to me. I feel like you just wear heels or sandals and call it a day. But with this, you can do some really cute lace up heels. You could do some sandals. You could do a cute little hat if you wanted to throw on a hat. You could do any of these bags on the left. You could do a lot, okay? So I just wanted to give you guys some options. So if you do find inspo in any of these outfits, you can just screenshot where I show the items. So this is something very different, okay? So we have this cute little milkmaid top with this plaid skirt. And I like this, kinda. I don't know how I actually feel about it, to be honest. I thought that these two pieces would be really cute together. It's kind of the same vibe, low key. But this top I got in a size small and this skirt I also got in a size small. And as you can see, the skirt pretty much stops like right at my ankles. So with this, you could definitely wear heels. You could do some sandals, of course. You could do like a platform sandal. These are just some shoes that I found on Google, literally just searching the internet, looking for stuff to go with these outfits. So I don't know 100% where all of this stuff is from that I'm showing. I'm just showing you guys like some ideas to get some inspo. But this outfit is different, okay? It's really cute. I really like these style tops. I think I'm gonna go and get this in like black or nude because they're very little booby friendly. So I actually really, really love this top. Okay, so next up we have this top. I actually had a skirt that I was gonna pair with it, but I thought that it looked not that great together. So I just threw on a pair of green pants that I have in my closet, which you guys have seen in a previous haul. And this is obviously something you could do a lot with as well. You can just take any color that's in this top to just bring it out and accentuate it a little bit more. So that's why I have all these green and pink accessories, but you can definitely do like a yellow. You could even do white if you want to, and that would look really, really cute. It would look very retro if you did white, but yeah, this is giving Cosmo and Wanda, okay? So yeah, this top I got in a size medium and I couldn't, tie it myself for whatever reason it just wasn't looking right so that's why i have it tied like this but that just shows you the versatility of the top so next up we have this really really cute asymmetrical satin one shoulder top and this abstract artsy style skirt and this top i got in a small and this skirt i also got in a size small and i thought that this would look really cute together because the skirt is giving like very much art and the top just kind of complements it very well because it's also a little unique. So I really like this one a lot. And of course I had to throw on a red lip and you guys know it wouldn't be a video of me if I didn't have something with a pop of a red lip. So obviously with this, you can definitely play with a lot of different colors because this is just like a black and white canvas essentially. So you can really do anything. But for me personally, you guys know, I have a soft spot for my red, my black, and my white. So here are just some options that I found. Nothing crazy, you know, with this outfit, I would definitely keep it very sleek and chic. Very simple because this outfit is the work of art in itself. It's the walking canvas, if you will. So with the accessories, you definitely want to keep it very, very simple. And honestly, I would just throw on like a clutch and some strappy heels and my red lip and we're good to go. Okay, so next up we have this cute abstract print dress and I just really loved the colors in this one. And this I got in a size medium and she is a little short on me, I'm 5'7". So I definitely should probably wear like some shorts underneath here just to be safe. But this is super cute and it does have a belt so you can adjust the waist and you know, make it look real snatched or you don't even have to use it. You can actually use it as like a headband if you wanted to, to kind of switch it up. But with this, obviously, you can keep it very simple and wear a white bag, a black bag, a red bag, and then the same with the heels. And also, you could throw on like a pair of thigh-high boots. I don't know exactly what kind. I don't know if that would like throw off the vibe. Yeah, no, nah, I'm gonna say no to the thigh-high boots. I'm just gonna stick with the lace-up heels because this just ain't it. So the last look we have is this really cute tie front top and these striped shorts. And I absolutely love this top. This top has like some high behind ratings on Shein. And I'm about to go get like all the colors because this top is such a vibe for the summer. But this top I got in a size large actually. And these shorts I got in a size medium. And obviously with this one, you could definitely play with a lot of the colors in the shorts. 
and that's what I did for the accessories. You could bring out the green, obviously the red. There's like a little teeny bit of like lilac. You could do a lot. So I would definitely have to say that this is my favorite look in the video because it is so freaking cute. It's such a vibe. And this is also the very last look we have in today's video as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Definitely give it a huge thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this. Also, let me know if you guys want to see any other places on the internet, okay? I know Shein is very popular. You guys love Shein. But also let me know down below any other places down below that you guys want to see me do like styling videos for and yeah give this video a huge thumbs up let's get her to 5,000 likes for your girl be sure to turn on your post notifications I never say this because I forget but a lot of people are like girl I'm not seeing your uploads and I've been uploading very frequently and some people have not been getting the notifications so make sure you hit that little bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video and if you're not caught up be sure to check out my videos for the last few weeks your girl has been consistent, okay? Thank you guys so much for tuning in. If you're new and if you're not, thank you so much for returning. Also hit that subscribe button if you are new because I would love to have you over here. And with all that being said, be sure to follow your girl on Instagram so you can see me style these pieces among others in the future. And with that being said, that is the end of this video. And I gotta go because I'm hungry, okay? So I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.